Oh, yeah, that's right. It is Madman Mondello coming at you live from the Gordon Garage here in beautiful Alabama. Let me tell you something. <laughs> you know, it never ceases to amaze me, technology. All right? Uh, you, you know, I wanted to do this video a little bit earlier. And, um, well, my router decides to be a complete and utter idiot. Okay. <laughs> I mean, it just disconnects. It's not there. That it's there. It's acting all crap. I'm like, seriously, really? <laughs> I just, wow. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> yes, the life and times of Tony. Oh my God. Um. All right. Anyway, Mr. Noah Adams. Okay. Noah went ahead. Okay, and um. Well, he picked up this lovely Star Wars edition console. All right, now, um, this thing he picked up for $8, believe it or not, from a friggin' thrift store. They said it was broken. <laughs> it wasn't broken, obviously, because it's here on my bench and running, all right? So, just like, you know. So, he picked it up for 8 bucks. all right, and um, he sent it to me. Now, mind you, it was completely filthy. If you watch the other video that I did on Facebook, I did a short on this thing. And um, yeah, it was it was brown, okay? <laughs> I was like, did they dump it in the sewer? Is that where you got it from or what? So anyway, and then I took it apart and it wasn't it wasn't getting any better. <laughs> I was like, good God. So anyway, I alcohol bathed the friggin' thing and I cleaned it all up and everything and I baked it and all that kind of good stuff. And um, well, here it is. And of course Noah wanted to add some custom work to it. You know, so I was just like, Yeah, we can do that. So, uh, he has a friend of his that did some of the artwork on this thing, okay? Um, his friend did this here, this here, and this one here, okay? Now, um, I did the Imperial, because he was, like, wondering, he was, like, going, like, you know, can you fill up that circle? I'm, like, going, like, yeah, so, anyway, I went ahead and I did an Imperial, uh, Imperial insignia for it. And, uh, pretty much 320 gig drive that he sent in. So, of course, I already H3'd it. We went ahead, we put the uh, remote LEDs in it, okay, and we did this lovely little graphical presentation of this stuff. Now, mind you, you can barely see the artwork here. Now, mind you, his friend did the artwork. This was uh, this was line art that he used, and he did line art here, okay? So, anyway, what we're going to do is I'm going to turn off this light for a fact, okay? And I'll tell you what, we're going to go ahead and we're going to boot this thing up. So, as you can see, we got the Star Wars The Force Unleashed. We've got uh, this dude with a friggin' lightsaber tearing down a friggin' Star Destroyer. We got the Imperial uh, symbol on there. And then we got Darth Vader versus this friggin' maniac over here. So, anyway, yeah, I am not that big of a Star Wars fan. But, um, you know, I mean, I like it. Don't get me wrong. I mean, I do. Okay? I really do. But. It's just, it's just, I'm not into the latest characters and all that kind of good stuff. But anyway, he wanted this thing just like that. Now, with the remote, you got red, you got green, you got blue, you got white, you got auto. Then you can speed it up. Okay, and I'll show you how we can speed that up right there, as you can see. And we can slow it down. And there's all different modes of operation for this thing. There's 368 modes of operation on this thing, as you can see. This one will give you an epileptic fit. All right, but that's okay. And uh, needless to say, there you have it. All right, so there you go. All right, and there's your Maniac freaking logos and all that kind of good stuff all lit up. Now, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go ahead and we're going to uh, swap over to the capture card. Okay? Now, 320 gig compliment, my friend. All right, so Noah, this is yours right here. We start off at Xbox 360. We start with the dashboard. As you can see, you got Battlelands, border, uh, border, uh, Borderlands, Battlefield, Bulletstorm, Call of Duty's out the yin yang, um, MW3, World at War. You got your College Hoops 2K8, Gears of War series, Grand Theft Auto series. You got five and four. Okay, they have Buffington Mod Loader on that thing. It's got Purge for GTA 5. All right. So uh, anyway, you know you got mod menus on those. You got your Halo. You got your Mass Effect trilogy, Minecraft, and of course you got NCAA Football 14. With college football revamped. And yes, we're still at version 17.1. I don't know what the hell they're doing over there. But whatever it is, they need to hurry up. Because PlayStation got it. PC got it. Why don't we have it? What, 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 what are we? Do we smell funny? Is that the problem? Oh my God. Anyway. And back to the dashboard. Now, 
Xbox Live Arcade, all right? You got a ton of Live Arcade on there as well to keep you busy. You have your homebrew section where your tools reside. Then you have your classic games. You got one classic game on this thing, Midnight Club 3 Dub Edition. You know, it's what I could fit on there. And you, then you have indie games on there. You got Trailer Park King, Voice Changer 360. And of course, you have emulators. You got Game Boy Advance, Sega, MAME, Super Nintendo, Nintendo, back to Game Boy Advance. All right, they're, they're fully loaded with about 9,000 ROMs on there, so I have a blast. All right, now, we'll go ahead. We'll get to the Xbox 360 dashboard. We'll load that up. Make sure everything is right and tight. And of course, it's up. It's online with a good KV. All right, now, mind you, we will hit the guide button. And as you can see, it has X Community Beta. For matchmaking capabilities and all that kind of good stuff so there is a uh, you know if you're looking for a uh, session and you remember you had to wait to get a, get a session in some of these games and everything because they're old and people you know not a lot of people play them or whatever well on this thing guess what you ain't got to wait because with x community beta you've got a bunch of stuff going on here modern warfare 2 black ops black ops 2 left for dead you, you know i mean you you, you can you, halos on there modern warfare 2 again call of duty 4 joinable so and so on and so forth and then of course you have players on there there's 71 right now okay on a nice little sunday and as you can see their servers are over in the right uh, over on the right side the, the uh perspective servers that they're on as you can see that xpo you got cypher you got infinity you got uh let's see here you got alliance alliance yeah yeah okay so on and so forth and infinity and more infinity and alliance and so on and so forth okay so you got a ton of you got a ton of people on there. All right now, okay, over in the right side of the screen, okay, there's your set there's your system settings. You got enable features, custom matchmaking, force mod force modded matchmaking, change your online status, change your username, save settings. So as you can see, you know your instructions are over on the right side of the panel right there, and what to do is right here. Okay, so there you have it. So we'll back out of there now. That's X Community. It's a nice little add-on, that's for sure. And then, of course, you have your cheats here. These are on your fifth tab. These uh, these are Advanced Warfare cheats, Ghost cheats, BO2 cheats, and Modern Warfare 3 cheats. To disable, hit A. To enable, hit A. Very easy. Um, to uh, when you're in when you're in a session, hold in the left trigger, push down the left D-pad. That'll open the menu. Use A to select. Use uh, use B to back out. You can use the uh, the D-pad for the uh, for the arrows to to make your selections and all that kind of good stuff if that's what's available and all that and then of course in ghost bo2 and modern warfare 3 all you got to do is just press in on the left d-pad to open it use uh use uh use x to select and b to back out all right so anyway there you go that's your mods right there we'll go back we'll bring that back to aurora and noah there you have it brother all right she's all done we're going to ship it out tomorrow you have your tracking number and information uh, tonight I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna get that uh, we do click and ship so of course you'll have your tracking number and all that and then it'll be shipped off to the post office tomorrow because that's when they're open all right they're not open on Sundays unfortunately but anyway we'll get it all done and all that and Noah I want to thank you for your business I really do appreciate it like I said I'm glad that you like the console I'm glad that, that you were able to uh, contribute also some of the artwork and everything that was really cool you know I mean like I said I don't mind doing that it's really, it's really awesome to get other people's uh, input and their ideas, you know. So anyway, I really do appreciate it. Thank you very, very much. And uh, we're going to ship it off, and uh, you'll have it in two to three days. Remember also, my friend, you have to sign for this thing when it comes, okay? So somebody better be there to sign for it, all right? But anyway, guys, listen, you all have a good one. I'm going to holler at you later. I got a custom Oakland Raiders console now that I have to build. So, anyway, you all have a good one. I'm going to holler at you later. Take care, guys. Have a great day.